All right, so we broke free. We are now in the secret area and we have our team. Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys, and welcome to another one of my Robothorium playthrough gameplay videos, playing through the entire game probably several times and we are about to hit mission two. Let me introduce you to John Wint. He's the leader of Humanobots, a cosmopolitan faction who is peacefully resisting the rule of Chancellor Yaklov. My dear sire, rather than waste time talking, how about we visit the decommissioned Bratic factory? The cozy accommodation should allow you to go, blah blah blah. And who do we have there? Halt! Alright, he seems more like my kind of guy. Alright, so what do we have here? Have you considered the opportunity not to kill anyone on your way here? Great stuff. So we have Dr. Peaceful and Dr. Angry Red Robot. My kind of guy. So I'm just giving it a little bit of time here in case you guys want to be reading all this stuff because I'm not going to be doing it every single time. But, I mean, if you're like going through this the first time, you may want to see it. So what are we going to be doing here? Alright, so this here is where robots are made. Good stuff. And John Wint is telling us a little bit about that stuff. And robots, weapons, chips. This is where it all comes from. And one day, we'll all come back, and when we return, we'll break the door down, my kind of guy. Alright, so I'm gonna be picking up the pace a little bit here, I think. Let's... Oh, we already have three options. Where to go? Oh man, I should be streaming this. Sector. Access to next sector is locked. Great. And we have materials. Let's see what we're gonna be getting. In the beginning, robots were designed to replace humans in factories, hospitals, landfills, but then they started dreaming. <laughs> Alright. Great. They want to recondition us. Oh, okay. Okay, so they made robots and then they wanted to control them. I guess <laughs> I guess that's kind of smart. Okay, and now we have unlocked the next sector. But I think I want to go scouting a little bit here in the dungeon. Because I do like... Oh, we have a battle. And what do we have? Ah, right tech agents. Let us show them what kind of alloy robots are made of. Yeah, I think so. All right, so what do we have? A supporter and... Two gunmen, I think, while well, they're fast. All right, loaded shot. Or oh, let's just see what. Uh, yeah. So we apply a weak spot with that, which will allow us to deal additional damage. Charming it. Thorium focused. Yeah, it's gonna be taking so much extra damage. We want to get that one away. And here we have. Hmm. We already have some overload on it. Ah, oh, we almost took it out. So our song will convert the overload into damage on an entire line of opponents. Like really crazy stuff. Ah, uh, we can... Uh, oh, we did it. Well, I thought it was grayed out. But that's of course because of the weak spot and the thorium focused. Alright, so let's just charm another one. Thorium focused again. Great, we're gonna be dealing so much damage here. And yeah, let's just let's convert that overload into damage. Look at that, 150 damage. It is so crazy, the song. And apply a weak spot plus deal damage and as you can see because it's charmed where we're generating our shield on our units I mean the combination here having having the actress that applies charmed having the song that just deals look at this crazy damage here overheat and now we're gonna be able to just take oh no he used it that was rude that was rude well now he's done so I guess we can just pin him down <laughs> That was not the plan. That was not the plan. Should we charm into death? Right, let's just charm the other one there. All right. So we should be able to pin them down pretty peacefully. Now we can actually regenerate our shield, but I don't think we need to because our actress can do that as well. A lady. Ah, look at them sleeping. We're gonna plasmic wave. So this here is one of the things that I was talking about in the first video. If you attack something that is slower then the unit that has it, it will actually bounce to another unit, giving you like crazy amounts of damage for just one skill, like really cool stuff. Um, yeah, blah, blah. The violence, violence, we want that stuff. We're, <laughs> I'm going Doom style. All right, so let's continue our dungeon crawling a little bit here. I wanna explore. And we have another crate, goody. And we have random stuff. I don't entirely, like I don't know what the stuff we're getting at is. Some of it is for a workshop and stuff like that. Hack, I want to hack, because then we can see... No, we failed! Warning, danger level. 
All right, so look at the bottom left corner there. You can see the danger level. If it increases too much, it's gonna be really, really hard to complete the dungeon. Um, ah, this robot is not operational. Maybe you should upload yourself into it. Well, let's grab another one. Okay, hmm. I actually played with this type of robot at Gamescom and I'm not a fan. <laughs> I'm not a, like, it's not my kind of thing. It's like super supporty. But then again, I only had like a few very basic levels in here. So there are many things I don't really know yet and many skills I haven't seen, the specialization things. A lot of stuff that I hope to be digging into during the gameplay series here because uh, we can intoxicate. I hope we I hope we don't fail. <laughs> Enemies affected by corrosion. Great. It is such a win to have another EMP device. Are you kidding me? Yeah, we made it. Good. Good, good. Trad dodged. I don't want to be taking damage. <laughs> it's a bad thing. Yeah, ooh, what a great room to go up to. Well, let's try to go this way then. A surveillance room. Wow. I mean... This place is booby trapped. Ah, uh, finally, drone at your service. So, what can we see? Unexplored rooms. Give me some opponents, man, so that they can be slowed. No, no opponents. Oh, what a bummer. It is the best when you can discover opponents. Alright, well, ah, oh, great room. <laughs> this is a super dungeon. Ah, oh, let's go down. Another storage cage filled with goodies. No, we opened it and it increased the danger level. And now we. Success chances are decreasing. Intoxicate. From how I understand it, it is not a good idea to do it more than once because you cannot double corrode things from the air vent. And what do we have? Ah, oh, no. Stalked. And this is to align. Ah. Oh, oh uh, which is. Eh, so we have boosters and debuffers and eh. I don't like this. Alright. Well, we want to take this one out. We want to, or do we want to, because we are fastest, so we can deal double damage even though we should focus on that one, but I think, ah, of course you're gonna go like that, you freak. All right, Thorium Focus, we could use that so that it will take additional damage, but I'm thinking about charming it anyway, so it is, let's just put Thorium Focus on that one and then charm this one because charm deals damage and applies Thorium focused, so that is like a really cool option. And now we are stalked and overloaded. That's uh, eh. ah, don't be like that. Well, it's only mission two, so we should be pretty okay. I think so anyway. Even though I, I really don't like the new robot we got, but we have we have some we have some overload, so we could use the boleros, but we can also just increase it further because then they're gonna be taking crazy damage. Great, so now they are really boosted with the overload. We can use this one again to <laughs> right on. Uh, the skills are real. So we can Thorium focus something once again to just like boost up that damage. Yeah, that one had it already good. Well played. That was really smart in a bad way, but it's okay. It happens sometimes. <laughs> All right, so we should hopefully have so much overload now that we can uh, look at that 80 and 60%. We should be dealing crazy amounts of damage. Plus that one is Thorium focused, 240 to 135, crazy damage. And then we can bounce, and they're corroded. <laughs> this is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. Just charm that one to death. You are such a nice robot, lady. All right, and ha, huh, we have won the game. So we can just yeah apply cooldown because why not? And shoot. It's a win. Great stuff. And we actually don't have that much overload on our units, so it is a pretty good way. What's that? Uh, nothing cool. Well, I mean, it may be cool. I don't really understand all of those things yet. We will find out. All right, so we have... Are you kidding me? Well, let's deactivate the defense turret. Come on. Yeah. I wanted to explore, like, the areas before going to the triangle so that I can find... <laughs> you kidding me? Oh, man. All right. Well, I mean, what worked before should work again. Wow, it was fast this time. But, eh, well, let's just bounce those. And Thorium Focus, and then Charm, and you guys know the drill. We're going to do the same stuff again, and hopefully we're going to have the same amazing result. Charm, no, not Thorium Focused. Oh, man. 
it is so nice when it works. And that one is stalled, and that's not good because we're supposed to be dealing a lot of damage to the overload, but um, oh well. Now it is debuffed. Let's just increase the overload like that. Alright, 20% more. You can actually use that to also create like a stun lock kind of thing on your opponents, but I like using it for damage even more. So there, <laughs> I love that ability as well. Well, I guess we're gonna be doing the manual Thorium focus thing there, and we're gonna charm something. Or oh, we could apply Stalk to them. We could do that as well. Now, let's just. Uh, what to do, what to do. Let's just take that one out. It's nicer to have fewer opponents than have them all damaged down because every single turn these units regenerate part of their shield, so it's nice to just get them out of the way. And our song appears to be overloaded, which is. Huh? Nah. Come on, wake up, dude. You gotta play those drums. No? Oh, that's rude. Alright, well, it does. Uh, no, it bounced wrong. Oh, well. We're just gonna throw in focus then, and <laughs> look at our repair bot. Almost going into overload. Well, that's okay. So, play usability. And no. Wow, that was expensive. It overloaded now. I'm miscalculating things now. That is bad. That is bad. I am the fail. Well, I guess we're gonna... Hmm. Uh, yeah, well, we got that one out. I mean, I could have taken the first row to take out those two weaklings, but I really wanted to have, like, the support counter one out first. So, let's see. Charm, Thorium Focused, 115, and Corrosion. <laughs> oh, the combo is real. Oh, man. So amazing. So a freaking amazing. So away she goes. We're gonna take the big one because we have loads of overload left. And the level, yeah, level up. Great, great. More skill points to look into. All right, so let us go to the triangle. Yeah, I was thinking about should I look into the equipment. But what? All it took was a civil revolt to set things off when the robots took to the streets to demand their rights. Chancellor Yaklov ordered the purge. An unprecedented wave of repression that. Bum, bum, bum. Stop. They joined forces to create us and now they want to destroy us. The target on your back is part of your design, sire. It's either them or us. I say we take them down. That's what's gonna be happening. And did we get any equipment? <laughs> because they were just talking. I have no idea which new equipment I got. Oh, we can actually talent up in here. That is pretty cool. Well, I, I think I want to do that outside the mission as like a roundup kind of thing. What do we have here? Ooh, Mark, please pass down the Thorium Cauldron. Yeah, Mr. Yaklov will be proud of our handiwork. Uh, blah, blah. They're reconditioning a robot. Keep your cool and let them leave. Let them leave. They're just kind, petty humans. John Went, you are the weak. Yeah, one day you will understand that violence may serve to tear down, and violence may also serve to build. It's bedrock. Oh yeah, it's bedrock. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. Halt! I think we're... What are we? Have mercy, we're just doing our job. Oh, I get to pick, I get to pick. Kill. Bye-bye, humies. <laughs> you made the right choice, Sire. Together we will claim the world and take it. Never forget, robots all bust. Oh yeah. We made the right call there, I'm pretty sure. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, they're gonna survive without a wannabe butcher in their midst. Yeah, go away, John Went. Nobody likes ya, Dr. Kind. Nobody likes ya. That's not how we do war. Alright, did everything work out as planned? I understand that you had a difficult choice to make. These internal wars between rebel factions shouldn't even exist. Now is the time for unity. Yeah, stand together when you have pushed everybody away. Yeah, I get it. I get it. It's okay, Sarah. So, are we gonna go level 3? No, not even level 3 on the repair. Are you kidding? Oh, what's that? Another mythic thing. Increases the overload reduced when using the basic attacks. Nice. Very nice stuff. Alright. Let's head in here and spend those talents. I mean, this is only our second talent. And each of these have two options. So, I'm just gonna be one-upping what we had before. Going from 1 to 2 really making sure that the things we are boosting are going to be working like as often as possible or as much as possible. I kind of like that. And this year, 100% chance to apply Thorium Focus. 
very very crazy nice combination to have on the lady and this is a pretty bad unit for me i think we're gonna replace that one in hopefully soon i mean we can have five in total and we only have four so yeah i'm just thinking about can i do something fun here but i don't really like these abilities and uh, perhaps i will love this unit when i am like a bit more experienced right now i think it's pretty meh but we shall find out should we have so much equipment stuff here as well let's uh, should we just run by to see what we oh we have ceremonial drums increases speed thank you and what do we have there 46 and 66 that was pretty crazy but i do want to have the speed so i think we're gonna say no to the damage for now anyway and the zerker oh we have goodies for the zerker nice 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 great stuff and minus six speed like what are you not understanding me want the speed all right the lady new gadget great a mask common for healing two speed three speed we're taking the mask and slow weapon and what do we have there 33 3.4 more base damage i think that's better all right and yeah. <laughs> and of course we have a crap unit but we can put mythic stuff on it yay and i'm just saying crap unit of course because i haven't really figured out how to use it efficiently yet it's not a, i'm pretty sure every unit like serves a really good purpose in the game i yeah i need i need practice this is i mean day one gaming guys i'm gonna be pro no worries we're gonna be pro <laughs> all right so i think we did what we was in the black market uh, you will find everything you need and you will be able to sell what you don't need all right there is only one rule you were never here bum 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 so i think considering how much stuff we are getting i should just like start sorting things and selling them in between all the missions so that we don't have a thousand things like that all right pretty cool so anyway guys that was pretty much what i had to share in this video hope you enjoyed be sure to check out the game over at steam join the like crazy amazing community over at discord both for the game and for yours truly as well so anyway guys that was what i had to share in this video as always thank you very much and very much for watching